Okay, I'm going to go over the advantages and the easy installation of the Precision Speed Control Unit. Uh, this one is 33 and a third and 45. There are other models available. You can check the website or call. The stock power supply is okay. This is a step ahead in the sense that it's easy to select speeds between 33 and a third and 45 with a push button. And it's easy to adjust the speed using the fast slow buttons down here. So it's really plug and play. It comes in aluminum case. The precision speed control is really super handy. You can select 33 and a third or 45 without doing a belt change. You can adjust the speeds without taking the cover off using a screwdriver using the fast and slow buttons. And it's pre precision controlled. It also comes with a double pulley. Might be a good time to change your belts so let's go ahead and install this and see how it goes. The stock pulley is a little smaller than this one, so it's important to change this out or you will not get to speed. It's easy, the Allen wrench is supplied. The new part, the new pulley is right here. Put that bad boy right in there. Just gently tighten. Don't go crazy, it's not pulling the tractor. The supplied brass pulley has been installed on the motor. You've got to do that because it's a little larger diameter to accommodate the voltages produced by the precision speed control. So you're going to turn on the power switch and back. Then you need to press the on button on the unit. And then don't forget your motor switch. So what I'm going to do is use the RPM app. I like to put a piece of tape something to keep it centered and let's see okay it's running real fast right now so all we do is run this down using the slow button the control will retain the speed values after it is powered down and anytime you want to check speed if you're listening to something it doesn't sound right it's easy to use a tachometer or a phone app and dial in that speed just the way you want it you can easily dial in 33 and third. It will vary by a couple of hundredths of a revolution, which is 0.07%. Okay, using the handheld tachometer, let's see what we are, 33 and a third. So the precision speed control, easy to use, easy to adjust. All you need to do is plug it in where your old power supply was, change that pulley, and go ahead and adjust the speed.